Uh, hello, d and community, and welcome to Roll for Puppet, the show where we let the dice decide what kind of puppet we will be making today. <laughs> so, let's get rolling. Let's start by seeing what kind of animal we shall be making. Without a <coughs> And we have number five. Which out of our 100 random animals is a rabbit. Next, we'll go for a random accessory. <coughs> With number 10, we have... A mustache. So let's roll for an accent color. Yep. Hmm. A natural 20. What are the odds? <laughs> that means we have to roll twice, which gives us a 17 and a 19. Or beige and navy. But now it's time for the wild magic. <laughs> Ooh, number 10. What could that be? An upper body with arms, if applicable. Well, I think that's possible. Did you get all that? Yes, yes, I did. Good. Now make it so. I saw him. He's a little snappy today, isn't he? Either way, to summarize, we're going to have a rabbit with a mustache, a beige and navy accents, and upper body with arms. So let's get to crafting. I got some scrap bone. I got my scissors, and I got my glue gun warming up right here. I'm going to want to roll this up so it can be the top of the head. I'll just cut this into the piece I need, which in this case is like a rectangle. And with a glue and a tube, I think this will be fine for the top. Next, I think I'm gonna use this as a bottom jaw and I'm gonna glue this together like that to get that round shape I want. And I'll cut into the shape I need. So after some gluing and trimming, this is what I got. I think that will work just fine for the bottom jaw. And of course you can't have a bunny rabbit without that cute little upper lip. There you go, and I can glue these on. So I'm gonna cut a circle out of here and then I'm gonna glue it on top of this by doing that and that should give me a nice round shape. There you go, now the shape's in place. I just need to make a couple holes for my hand to fit in. So let's glue these together and then cover it with some white fleece. I also folded a piece of cardboard, put it in there, traced it around and cut it out to make a mouth plate. That's also gonna get covered fabric. So here's the head and the mouth plate, so let's glue them together. There you go, that's ready to go. Let's give them a little pink nose. And I'm gonna use one of my accent colors of bait for the inside of the ears, which I'm just cutting out of cardboard and the covering with fabric and gluing them on. So let's glue these on. There you go, now I'm gonna draw on some eyes, and I'll think they use a navy blue as an eye color. Let's cut out some teeth and put them on. How to make a mustache, I'll be using my flame grilled and whopper fabric. So I go on out and let's glue it on. You know I'm gonna cut off this cheek and glue it together. There you go, that evens the face out, now let's make the body which for this simple puppet is just gonna be a piece of foam with some fabric on it. And with the body glued on, I can start gluing on little arms I made and put little hands on there like that. And we'll add some sticks, add a little pink belly. You put it all together and you got yourself a nice rabbit with a nice mustache right here, some beautiful blue eyes, and a lovely ears like this. <laughs> Either way, if you enjoyed this video and wanna see more stuff that this guy right here makes, be sure to like and follow for more in the future. Bye everybody.